Okay, so it says an investor pays a hundred thousand today for a four year investment that returns cash flows of sixty thousand at the end of years three and four. Right. So sixty thousand in both of these scenarios. Now the cash flow can be reinvested at a four percent per annum uh effective. Okay. So using an, an annual effective interest rate of 5%, calculate the net present value of this investment. So we know that the equation to solve the um, net present value is always the initial outlay, aka investment, the money spent, plus the money that you're going to get back from it, right? So in this case, what we can do here is that we can... Uh, see that, well, cash flows can be reinvested at 4%, right? Um, instead of just uh, discounting 60,000 V to the 3 back and then 60,000 uh, V to the 4 back, uh, what we can do is that we can uh, reinvest the 60,000 at time 3 so we can combine both cash flows occurring here, right? So we could do uh, 60,000 times the reinvestment of, uh, the reinvestment rate of one, four percent, so it's this. Um, then we end up getting, uh, 62400, right? So when we get 62400, we could add that to what is occurring at time 4. So add an extra 60,000 and we end up getting 122400. Now let's discount it back at an annual effective interest rate of 1.05. That's what we're supposed to do. Now let's solve. So we know that 122400 times 1.05 to the negative 4 is 1,698.7829. Let's subtract the 1,000 from it. And then we'll end up getting 698.7, which makes C as the final answer.